Hello, and welcome to another Mario Party 8 minigame review! Up today we're playing the 2 vs 2 minigame Crops and Robbers. In this one, one player is trying to pull up a carrot, and the other player is trying to hit the Monty Moles. The first team to hit all of the Monty Moles and pull up all of the carrots will win. Basically, you're just trying to rob the crop. Yeah, whose plants are these? Are we stealing these or what? I feel like we are! Well, I'm not here to talk morals. Let's talk the minigame. I think the first thing I'll say about this one is that it's actually a not bad 2 versus 2 minigame. Like, you actually have to work with your partner to get things done since you each are doing half of what needs to be done. Well, kind of. You each can do your own thing, but there are some cases where one player has to hit the Monty Moles before the other player can pull the carrots. So it's a little bit working together, but not the entire time. Yeah, that's true. There were times when the path would be blocked by rocks and Monty Mole holes, and one of the partners would just be waiting for the other partner to clear things out so that they can move on to their section. That did get a little frustrating. If you were the partner waiting around, it was frustrating. But if you're the partner having to do the work, it's kind of nice to be needed as a teammate, I guess. It's not an ideal two versus two, but I like that you at least have to interact with each other sometimes. Yeah, but the idea of interaction leads me to what I think is the next issue with this one, which is that the controls are just a little bit finicky. Like you're playing with the Wii Remote upright, so when you have to use the D-pad to move your character around, it's kind of a stretch for your thumb. Well, that, and you have to be lined up just so. If you're not exactly where you need to be, you can't pull up the carrot or hit Monty Mall. And that's kind of annoying. Yeah, you're right. That was a little bit frustrating. But those drawbacks aside, I didn't hate playing this one. Like, it was fun trying to go around and either get all the Monty Moles or get all the carrots first. It's kind of fun having to hit the Monty Moles with your Wii Remote or, you know, pull out the carrots with it as well. Yeah, and I do like every time you play it that the course is a little bit different. I like that it changes. it. Yeah, that is another benefit. So overall, Props and Robbers is far from the worst minigame we've played in Mario Party 8. As far as two versus two minigames go, it's nice playing one that you kind of have to work together with your teammate, even though it does have some drawbacks when one of you is needed and the other one can't move on until that partner does their job. The controls can also be a little tough to use, but on the flip side, the controls are also fun when you're hitting the Monty Moles or pulling up the carrots. So all in all, we're giving this one three stars out of five. Well, that's it for today. If you enjoyed this review, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Up next, we'll be playing Cut From The Team. Oh, well that doesn't sound fun. Yeah, I hate to break it to you, but I'm cutting you from this team. Well, you can't cut me from this team if I leave. I'm cutting myself from the team. All right, well, if you want to see me review Cut From The Team all by myself, come back for our next video. Well, I mean my next video. Hope to see you then. Yeah, you hope to see me then.